Hi, I'm going to introduce you to this uh, new ergonomically designed multifunctional tape measure which currently has patent pending status. I'll show you some of the features, the first one being this tape end which sticks up above the tape measure housing and this is in order to enable you to put your thumb there and take a pen or a pencil if you're drawing a line and hold that for scribing. The other thing it does is if you're measuring, let's say you're in a basement measuring across floor joists, uh, stick your tape out, hook it onto the floor joist, and then pull your tape out so you don't have to turn it over or trying to hook onto something. So it makes it way more convenient and you can stick the tape out quite a bit further. Uh, what we have here is three body styles, all similar to a standard 25 foot tape measure. The difference in these is how far out the face of the tape sticks out. This one's just a short one, the medium, and this is a longer one. And this enables you to grab the trigger lock here that locks the tape in place and place your thumb here. And then you can slide this along your material, whether it be plywood or drywall or whatever you're working with. So this trigger lock, the idea behind this is you squeeze the housing and the trigger lock and it holds the tape firmly so the tape will not be able to slide in or out. It has both a convex and a concave rubber pad there that takes the same tape as the tape, so when you lock it firmly, you can extend the tape quite a bit. And also when you're rewinding the tape measure, you control the, re control the rewind speed with this. Or if you're working out in the rain, you can squeeze it lightly, and as it rewinds, these two pads will act as a squeegee and clean all the dirt and water off. So I'll give you a quick example of how this works. Take your pen, and your tape measure, and just make a line like that. So all three of these, this is the one with the, the shortest body, so on this one you probably grab the whole tape, it still allows you to fit your thumb in there. Put it on your material, and make a line like that. So we've got another one, I'll make a line, medium sized one. Same thing. Notice you get a nice straight line. <clears throat> this will allow a carpenter to avoid using a chalk line in many instances. Um, I have another body style here. This is the two spool one, which is quite easy to hold on to. And a large end here. That's it. So another advantage of this design is uh, it could be used for a square in many instances. As you can see, the, the face holds the tape quite firm and, and just, there you go. Not an accurate square, but cutting out for a window in drywall or a little bit of siding, cutting out for a window would work in that case. So another use for these tapes is when you're doing a radius. So it has the standard hole there to hook onto a nail for doing circles. You just hook onto the nail there, and now this allows you to twist the tape, and with this large face, you can put your pencil, pen, or whatever in there, and just do a radius like that. I'll give you another example with this one. square line.